he was. <laughs> this nigga's crazy. Rapper of the year. Oh. J. Cole for me. J. Cole. Rick Ross. What? Rick Ross. Nigga, hold up. Hold up, Brian. Hold up. Gotta be Rick Ross. Had me, a, me, it gotta be Rick Ross. So from aside from the album, why? I'm not even talking <laughs> about just the album, the previous album too. The one that he I dropped just, just before 2021. No, I respect that. I respect that. Damn. What's it? You know the name of it? I mean, Lemon Pepper Freestyle was hard. He had a dope feature on Let me see. whose album recently? He had a dope ass feature. Richer than I ever been, and uh, uh, what was it? Uh, out. Port of Miami too. I think it was 2019. I like that album. I like it better than Richer than I ever been. That's my thing though. I think Richer than I ever been is probably his worst. No, nah, not his worst album. Hood Billionaire probably his worst album. Rapper of the year, Rick Ross. I think I'm gonna stick with that man. Really? Yeah. Something about Rick Ross, bro. There's something about there's something so perfected in his music. Every song that I wow. can't figure out what it is, but every cadence that he gets, every beat that every beat that he gets, everything always sounds perfect. It, even wow. if the bars aren't good, it always something always sounds perfect in his music. It's something about he's like he got to be an A and R for himself, bro. Yeah. The dude is. Incredible! It's incredible. You might be the only person in the world. Who I might thinks be. He's a rapper of the year, I'm and I like that. that. Though, That's why you're here. I think Rick Ross is better than probably ninety percent of the music industry, bro. And niggas just. I don't can agree with that, but then why this album let me down. Something. Hold on. He walked out on the eighty five South show the other day. My boy was pissing himself. Why do you think he? Why do you think that occurred? I don't know. I seen that. Didn't he say? <laughs> didn't he say they had to catch a flight or something? Is it because he's that like that big? Like, ah, uh, bro, I'm pretty sure it wasn't that. It had to be some type I of saw scheduling. I Edwin conflict. comment on a post. He <laughs> was like, he was adding Rick Ross. Conflict. He's like, you think you're the shit? You ain't nothing. I did not say that. I do not put that ego like away, that. motherfucker. On, bro. <laughs> I was like, bro, be careful. He's gonna bother. I the said, state. I said, I think I put one. Your album's not that great. I think it's like, I think it's like bad or something. And then, then I put two. Stop walking out on people who are giving you a plat who who you don't need give it, you though. a platform to speak on or something. And no, not, not to say that, that was correct. But yeah, I know he doesn't it. need it, but like no, they he, need him. Yeah, if we're being him, honest, sure. and they, he made them viral by just he walking did. out. I feel you. Out, was like by using the bathroom and never coming back. They kind of congratulate. They kind of like um. At first they were like, oh, I'll do that shit too, blah blah blah. No, but then like, they then they got mad. They're helping each other out. I know he has a bigger name than One hundred percent. I'm gonna say we're I'm gonna stick with Rick Ross, man. Okay. Something about him is just musically adequate every time. He's always that he never misses. He does not miss. Wow. For me, in I my like ear, this left field shit. In my gotta have ear, you back on Brian with miss. the left field shit. I like this left field he has shit. Never <laughs> missed in my ear. We gotta have Brian on for the next year. Man. Every year, every time wrap ups, we gotta need Brian. <laughs> I swear to God, man. Because you need to collect the different artist, different man. selections. What you about know? you, Adam? Um, did you say yours? No, I had it. I like Wrath. Well, since I have J Cole. Number one, I'll just stick to Cole. Um, him, uh, Ransom, and Nas are my f- favorite mm. rappers this year, especially Nas. But um, no, I'll put I'll put J Cole's. No, actually, I'll put I'll go with Nas. Say to Nas. Be say Nas. Say Nas. I'll Nas go with deserves Nas, it. man. Over Cole. Yeah, Nas he had so many bro. different flows this year, bro. Nas like, is J Cole's two father. Albums, no, two albums in this year. Yeah. And they were yeah. both really fucking good. Yeah, Mag- I, like I said, I think Magic is better than King's Disease too. So. Nas is J. Cole's father, too. If we're talking about <laughs> it, he said it. Yeah, that's true. Yep. Let Nas down. Let him down. And then, yo, when Nas made that track, though, made Nas proud, incredible. Oh, my God. That was incredible. I, 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 I think I, I cried that day. I think I cried listening to that. I think I would have cried I if I was J. Cole. Because it was his response record to J. Cole. He's oh, like, really? you didn't let me down. You made me proud. Yeah. This is what you did, blah, 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 by acknowledging me. It was like a full, beat. full 360 Same moment. Beat, but it's called Made Nas Proud instead of Let Nas Down. Wow. Yeah. There's respect there, bro. But that's his um, his OG. He signed to Jay-Z, but his guy is Nas. His and, it, and it's true because if you think about it, like you could compare him to Nas, I would say more than Jay-Z. If you listen to J. Cole and Nas, they're way more similar than J. Cole is to Jay-Z mm-hmm. because they have like the humble talk. Yeah. Nas has his drug that, talk, like, but not like that. Yeah. And Nas is kind of now getting into his braggadocious rap. Yeah, yeah. He wasn't really braggadocious back then like that. Yeah, yeah. He was more critical. Like, he sounded like a pimp now. Like he's Yeah, like, he's more braggadocious and like crypto and uh, making money and this and that. Because, nigga, he has the money, so now he could talk like that. I like this Nas. I yeah, like yeah. this version of Nas. Also, this is another reason why I like Rick Ross as my artist of the year. When you listen to Rick Ross's music, you're not getting shit on. You're, you want to do better. When you listen to a lot of these artists' music, it's, oh, 
y'all niggas broke, I'm in this role. It's different when you listen to Rick Ross. Rick Ross makes you want to do more. It's inspiring. Mm. It's not. Mm. He makes you feel like you're in the car with him when mm. he's driving the Rolls Royce. You're with him. You can you can do this too. He lets you know. Other artists is just y'all niggas broke. I'm in this Rolls Royce. I'm fucking your bitch. I'm doing this. I'm mm. I'm tired of that shit, bro. I'm trying to elevate. That's yeah. why I feel like Russ is that. that. Brian is signs of MMG. I told you, you niggas. <laughs> he's Mister MMG. High bridge the label. Don Q. Oof. Wow. Oof. Oh man, so comment down below you guys with your list. They gonna love me for my ambition.